in this part relate to area of a circle to the area of a sector. A, a sector of a circle is the region bounded by two radii and the intercepted arc. What is the area of a sector MQM? This is the area of sector. To be able to find the area of a sector, first I would like to remind you what is the area of whole circle? The area of circle is pi times r squared, actually, times alpha over 360. What is the alpha over 360? If you are looking for the area, which area of a whole circle, what is the measure of the whole circle is 360. If you substitute 360 over here, divided by 360 is 1. So alpha stands for the measure of arc you are looking for to find the area. Now, can you please tell me, what is the measure of this arc? It's 7 to 8. By the way, if this is 78, what is the measure of central angle? The central, the measure of central angle, the measure of central angle is also 78. Now, to be able to find, to be able to find the area of a sector, the area of a sector you are going to find pi times r. What is the r, which is radius 10 squared, times what is your measure of r? You will find its area. It's 78 over 360. If you calculate this, ladies and gentlemen, 10 squared is 100 pi times 78 over 360 which means that which means that when you when you multiply this 78 times 100 is 7800 times pi over 360 which is equal to approximately 68.07 so this is the area of sector MQM. Next, what is the area of the sector? To be able to find the area of the sector, remember the formula. The area of sector. Pi times R squared times alpha over 360. Alpha is the measure of the R you are going to find its area. Tell me, what is the radius of this circle? Pi times 3 squared times what is the measure of R? The measure of R is 165. 165 over 360. If you calculate this, 3 squared is 9 pi times 165 over 360. What is this? 165 times 9 times pi over 360, which is equal to approximately 12.95. So this is the area of sector. Next question. To be able to find the area of the sector of the circle, remember the formula, the area of the sector, pi times r squared times alpha over 360. What is the radius of the circle? The radius of the circle is 10. And what is the measure of r? 59. If you substitute pi times 10 squared times 59 over 360. 10 squared is 100 pi times 59 over 
360. If you use your calculator, ladies and gentlemen, 5,900 times pi over 360 is equal to approximately 51.48. 48. So this is the area of sector. In this part, we are going to find the area of a segment of a circle. What does that mean, area of a segment of a circle? Area of a segment, segment of a circle is here, this part. So, ladies and gentlemen, to be able to find the area of a segment, we are going to understand the main idea. This is the main idea. To be able to find this part, you first you need to calculate the area of sector. We already learned that how to find the area of a sector. So let me write it down. Area of segment is going to be calculated. First, find the area of sector and then subtract this part. Area of triangle minus area of triangle what does that mean ladies and gentlemen let me take this part over here so this is the center to be able to find this part first I am going to find the whole area which is called area of sector and then I am going to subtract this part the area of triangle and that what is going to be left this is going to be left which is area of segment this is the idea we are going to use to figure out area of segment let's find the area of segment before that I would like to give one more information to be able to find area of triangle, we learned this in the previous topics, ladies and gentlemen. Let's say that we have two length of the sides. The length of the two sides, we know that. And also we know their angle between them, which is, for example, alpha. To be able to find the area of this triangle, area of the triangle you can multiply the length of the sides a times b times you need to get the sine of the angle in the middle sine alpha over 2 this is how we are finding the area of triangle all right let's find the area of segment of this question do I know that what is the area of sector? Of course, pi times r square times alpha over 360 minus area of triangle. If the radius is 8 centimeter, what about this part? 8 as well. Why? Because our x stands for radius. So what is the area of the triangle? 8 times 8 times sine of the angle in the middle sine 60 over 2 if you substitute all the given information you are going to get pi times radius is 8 8 squared times can you please tell me what is measure of arc what is the measure of arc 60 substitute 60 over 360 if you calculate this part, 8 divided by 2 is 4, 2 divided by 2 is 1, 8 times 4 is 32, times sine 60 is, if you use the calculator, you will find radical 3 over 2. Now, let's calculate this part. When you simplify 60 divided by 60 is 1, 360 divided by 60 is 6. 8 squared is 64 pi times 1 over 6, which is 
divided by 6 minus, when you simplify this, you will get 16 radical 3. After that, if you calculate this, you will get 64 pi over 6, 64 times pi over 6 minus 16 times radical 3. Then the answer is going to be 5.79. So this is the area of segment. Don't forget, this is the method we are going to apply. Next question, what is the area of segment? This is the area of segment I'm looking for. To be able to find the area of segment, you first find area of sector and then subtract area of triangle if this is 10 feet then this is going to be 10 feet as well if the central angle is 90 can you please tell me what is the measure of this arc is 90 degree as well so let's substitute the formulas let's find this formulas first pi r squared times alpha over 360 minus 10 times 10 times sine 90 over 2. Substitute, what is the radius? 10. 10 squared times what is alpha, which is measure of r, is 90 over 360 minus 10 times 10 is 100 divided by 3 is 50 times sine 90 is 1. When you simplify this, 90 divided by 90 is 1. 360 divided, 360 divided by 90 is 4. Now you will get 100 pi over 4, which is minus 50. If you simplify this, you will get 25 pi minus 50. You can either leave your answer 25 pi minus 50, or you can use calculator to find the value. 25 times pi divided by, sorry, minus 50, which is equal to approximately 28.54. Both of them are correct answer. This is area of segment. Next question, what is the area of the segment? To be able to find the area of the segment, if this is 5, meter what is the length of this five this part five meter as well if this is 144 degree this is the measure of r what is the central angle central angle is 144 degree as well remember to be able to find area of segment area of segment first find the area of sector and then subtract area of triangle 2 sorry pi r squared times alpha over 360 is going to give you area of sector minus 5 times 5 times what is the angle in the middle what is the angle in the middle sine 144 divided by 2 if you substitute all the given information what is the radius is 5 5 squared times 144 divided by 360 minus 25 sine 144 over 2. Now let's calculate this part. If you use if you use the calculator, you will get 25 25 times pi times 144. Divided by 360. This is going to be approximately 31.42. This is minus sine 144 
times 25 divided by 2. This part is approximately 7.35. When you subtract them, you will get 31.42 minus 7.35, which is equal to 24.07. This is your answer.